Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Slifer, and as a person who play a game, tower defending game, which is Primordial Defenders 2, I have found something different than we supposed to see in our game, and this is Alien Tokens. Right, the amount I have received every battle and every hard round and this particular battle it's 349 alien tokens and you can trade them um for a special magics heroes and towers i will show you just in a minute um why do i want to show you the battle in our Facebook uh, page, which is Primordial Defenders 2 fans page group, um, we have a couple posts about the new event, uh, which is about in the game. And the event is um, Area 51. And as you all know, Area 51 is a big deal for the last couple of months in a country. And this country, I think, was... America. I'm not too sure. I think it is America. And the developments of the game have created Area 51. Battles, they are, I would say, hard. Uh, for the most players who will play the game like overall, they will find themselves in a really, really, really hard spot and position because they have made a couple new creatures uh, which you know, are increasing 20% more attack damage or 20% more toughness or 20% more health and stuff like that. There are not many, but there are some of them which are pretty annoying and pretty stronger than the usual creeps we supposed to fight against. Right, the visual battle ground it's I would say 10 points from 10. I love the way they've done it, I love the way they've done the gates right here and everything. I love, I love everything about the map, okay? But um, I would say this is a little bit too much, just just a tiny, 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 a little bit too much. Um, why am I saying this? I'm saying this because, um, let's say like this, they could have um, took off some stuff, you know what I'm saying? But it is okay, it is okay, I'm not complaining and I am actually going to die at the moment because I don't have enough power. Nah, that should be fine. <laughs> that should be fine. At least that boss dying soon and he's pretty annoying because he has 30% natural armor which you cannot reduce with anything. Not with purified tower, not with, with, with silence, with absolutely nothing. And I'll be absolutely happy if he dies soon, if you know what I'm saying. Right, about the battle. The battle is not too, way, way too hard, but it's a little bit annoying. Even if I did got my um, premium subscribe, uh, which give me um, by four um, speed, I would find myself in a really hard and really difficult spot to farm the new uh, alien tokens. I do, I do like the idea they have made the whole new map for Area 51. Um, the visual, uh, like the map, is absolutely outstanding. It's, it's brilliant. They have made generously regarding a brilliant job. Um, whoever created this map and whoever actually draw this map and actually made this map. I will give him probably 10 from 10 points because it's absolutely, absolutely spot on for area. 
<laughs> forever, forever 51. Um, I am not happy about a lot of stuff in this event, and I'm happy about a lot of stuff in this event. So it's a bit like 50 50. But I cannot actually make a decision. Um, after all, am I going to farm a lot in this map, or I'm going to go for a normal usual map which we all are supposed to see and play. So I'm a little bit like it's so-so, do you know what I'm saying? Because in my case, to be honest, um, I don't know actually how much HP the monsters right now have, but when you see my new volcano, which is dealing that much damage, which you're seeing right now for um for twelve seconds, so I'm doing like two hundred and sixty-eight, or I would say it's seventy, two hundred seventy-two damage per cell, and I have seven of them, which are actually shooting the boss seconds ago, and every second I'm dealing around. 7 million damage in total and this is this is a lot you know what i'm saying this is the towers which i have used and the magic i didn't use too much my prime t-show and i didn't use too much my um spray tower i just brought them with me because i i find them um uh, fancy <laughs> if you know what i'm saying right the map is brilliant you can see the main base you can see these bunkers and stuff and and, and everything in the, the military stuff i do miss trucks and and things and, and and kind of laboratory things and but i do love it 10 from 10 about the map is absolutely brilliant it's obviously in desert somewhere i don't i don't know where but i will give them 10 points something i don't actually understand at the moment even no one in our facebook group which uh, are pretty strong players because they have reached level 280 something um it's why i do have only one battle why i don't have three four or five battles right one million two hundred fifty six thousand you can see this is one of the new monsters. This monster is a harpy scout and obviously it's alien stuff and things. But it's a predat it's a predator uh, in the service of the government. Uh and vulnerable to ground attacks. Uh which is bullshit because you obviously have your uh, um <coughs> uh, flaming cannon duh which i made video about it duh and you can ob obviously deal a lot a lot more better than with um air guard and with the stars which i i i, I generally don't don't feel fancy to use but it has 20 percent more health than the ordinary harpy which is um it's a lot there are a couple more new monsters which you can actually meet and you can actually fight against in, um, in this uh, battle. Um, <clears throat> you can have up to five uh, fuel um, thinning and you are fighting for this um, alien tokens. Right here you can see how many alien tokens I have. Don't look at them everywhere. Because you will not be able to how many alien tokens you have. I just earned around 6k alien tokens. And like I think every every day or every I don't know. I think it's every 24 hours I get one few um rewarded. And it's a bit I don't know. I haven't finished them yet, uh, I might try, but I think it's a bit struggling to farm them. Um, and to be more particular with you, I will show you why. <clears throat> In the shop you have boosters, you have random, you have currency and things and stuff like this. But you have Area 51 shop. This one here 
it's multiplying my alien tokens by two uh, which I don't find fancy because 1499 stars it's a lot one thing I like about this is this is not like the previous events this is not permanent this is here like forever I would have thought or till the development don't say it's over uh, but I do love it I do love it and you have special alien boosters rare alien boosters epic alien boosters legendary alien boosters and fantastic alien boosters let's see the special in the special one you can see the alien mechanic which increases the toughness of mechanical towers and damage deal by located by 10% which is pretty okay I have this locator which obviously um, basic damage is 40% higher than the normal detector but after we have the sky eye we don't usually use it but I do find it pretty fancy this is mechanical tower which is the new version of the stone tower and have 40% more toughness which I do find really brilliant I do love that green, don't get me wrong, but <laughs> uh, it is it is actually, um, okay. We do have our assault tower, which is just the normal assault tower. We do have our normal detector. We do have our normal clear sync tower. We do have normal, um, we, had, uh, we have a normal deadly strike, normal fireball, normal ice storm and bros tokens as well. So. This is our special alien booster. About the rare booster, which means your cards are with rare rarity, is the alien operator, which increases the damage deal by splitter by 10%. We do have splitter, which is even a better version of the leech version of the sniper tower. So this deal massive damage with a single shot half. A four percent chance to ignore the target arm. So, like every ten shots, you have eight shots ignoring the target's armor, which is okay because we have five or six uh, monsters with ten, fifteen, or thirty uh, percent armor, and a couple of them are bosses as well. And ignoring this thirty percent armor is a pretty big deal. But this is a single damage tower, anyway. Uh, normal spray tower, normal frost tower, normal machine gun, normal sniper tower, which you can see is only 60% uh, ignoring target. Normal ice tower, normal cursed tower, normal dragon tower, normal prime explosion, normal target, stone shield, magma, true vision. I would give 10 points. 10 from 10. I don't actually know what here this means, the number of spells. I think this might be a glitch, that one here. I'm not too sure, I am not too sure. And we do have some silver tokens as well. This is our rare alien boosters. We do have our epic alien boosters. Alien Dispatcher. Um, increases efficacy of repairing tower in battle 10%, which is obviously the new repairing tower. Um, <clears throat> our member in our Facebook page just said to me uh, and post in the Facebook group uh, a video about uh, the battle he's doing and he said this tower is better than normal engineering tower simply and because it's repairing everything in the range not just one by one or one after another it's repairing everything in the range and this is mental mental Still same thing, I think it might be a little bit better than the normal engineering, so I'm not too sure. I am not too sure. Um, I don't know. Repairing tower. Uh, excuse me? So, repairing tower have a less repairing... Hmm, has less repairing power than the normal 
I don't know. I have to see. I have to see. The toughness is same. Damage is same. So they're pretty much the same. But someone told me this repairing tower is actually repairing everything in the range, which is mental. I, I will. I will try to get one, and I will see. Normal wear guards, machine gun MK2, seismic slammers, spirit tower, fog tower, mortar, which is brilliant. Tempest, thunderbolt, tornado. This is magic light. And here you can have a premium, which is brilliant, and silver socket. So this premium and this silver socket is a pretty good chance, but you need 50k for this. Oh, I don't get one. Sorry? Only one? <gasps> you have to be kidding me. So this is just five. I have only 57. <gasps> this will be impossible, honestly. Right, ladies and gentlemen, I will stop here with my video and I will show you what it's all about, about the legendary alien booster and fantastic alien booster. And I will show you something which I have uh, managed to earn. <laughs> and it's a bit more special. But this will be in the second part of our alien invaders. So... I will see you in my next video, which will be shortly with you. Thank you and see you later.